So we're going to focus on the dynamic bid. Um, it's a very easy process. We're just naming the source. Um, one vendor can have multiple sources because of things like shared and exclusive or tier one, tier two, tier three quality sources. Uh, again, setting partners per lead, whether that is exclusive or non-exclusive. Uh, setting a cap back. So this is more of a protective measure for you. You know, let's say I don't ever want to return $50, even if I can sell that lead for $1,000. Um, we do have margins primarily handled in the filter sets at this uh, system. Uh, filter sets can be handled in a lot of different ways. And the filter sets does give you the most flexibility. If that is too much, which it is for some companies, we can put it in the source setting and just make it a little bit easier for everybody. Um, outside services is that third party API calls for lead scoring that we discussed. And then uh, this is what we do with that lead if the lead comes in and goes into manual review, or if there is a post reject, these settings then for reporting purposes, set the cost of those to zero. So in your reports, it does not show that you owe that vendor anything. Now, the good news is that if you do post reject a lead to a vendor, they will typically turn around and recalculate their best revenue scenario to see who, who else they can sell that lead to and sell that in real time to somebody else. So that does shave uh, things like refund processes, gives the vendor more opportunity to sell that lead to somebody else in real time, which allows you to not have things like refund premiums put in place uh, if you are buying those leads. So at the end of this process here, we're gonna automatically do things like create the API key or use the existing one. And then we'll be able to download the PDF. This is all that is needed to send to the vendor. So, hey vendor, here you go. Here's your source settings. Here's your specific switches or things that you need to include. Here's your potential responses, and then a link to our testing page to give them some additional details. So that setup is pretty similar the, with the uh, fixed cost as well. And at the end, you're gonna get those specs from this wizard so that you can send it to whoever building your website, uh, direct posting or ping posting into your system.